obviously it's it's a little bit different than everybody else does, but uh, you know I find out you know you have to be a little bit smarter to think about stuff you do. Uh, and I know there's a lot of people hiring the you know conditioning coaches. Uh, you know, it's uh, one thing. It's it, it's great, but on the other side, you know, uh, I always believe you have to push yourself because the the coach who's spending time with you during the summer, he's not gonna be on a bench with you during the hockey game when you know when the game is on the line, and who's gonna push you then? Uh, so you have to be able to push yourself. Uh, that's what I always believed. Uh, other things uh, I find out. Uh, you have to, you have to make it. Your workout you have to be mentally, I would say, very easy. So you kind of have to do a lot, and kind of your brain don't get tired. So I'm trying to do it fun stuff. You know, uh, I can. I don't think I can go to the gym and be there for an hour and a half. Uh, uh, after ten minutes, I have to leave. I'm not. My body's not used to that. So. But I find out when I when I, when I work out in the swimming pool, you know, outside, you know, you can be there for a whole day, and, and mentally you don't get tired because you don't even think you're working out, and you can do a lot of a lot of similar stuff like you're doing in the at the gym. And also, I'm trying to do only stuff I really need it for hockey, so I don't you know I don't try to build muscles I don't really use it in hockey. So you know, I'm trying to do exercise exactly the same way I play hockey. Thank <laughs> you.